Hello everyone, welcome back to a new episode of Lies of P. Last time we left off, we made it to a new area and saw a person that was uh, freaking out about dying. Um, someone mentioned that was probably Medoro, and I definitely, definitely think that's, uh, that is correct. That probably was Medoro. So, uh, as for other things... Let's go ahead and grab a level, I think. Because I believe I can afford one. Soon, but be warned. Whoop. You're walking into hell. And I should know. God, I'm so you just used to skipping through all your initial dialogue. I escaped from there. I had to leave a lot behind. And that is why I woke you. Like you, clever one. I am more than I appear to be. I'm ready for you to see the real me. Show me that you're ready to. Please. Save us. Save Krat. I knew it. There is a secret passage. The stalkers must be getting information from the alchemists. It might be the only path to their base. Hurry. Whatever choice you make, yeah, that's what I was- that's what I was expecting initially. So you came from the alchemist base. Alright. Uh, I think I want more capacity. Just- just get that weight up. So we can equip even more crazy things. Like I said, ideally I get some of these things on and like the conquering amulet and stuff like that. That's what I would really like to have. Um, we might have to take off Deus Ex Machina if I ever want to do that, though. Because at this point, I don't know if we're going to be able to get high enough capacity for some of that stuff. Okay, so... I think that's kind of everything we need to do, right? I think that's all of the side stuff I had to follow up on and... All that jazz. I don't think I'm missing anything. There's probably like a point of no return. I could definitely still be missing stuff. But we've done stuff for you. We've done stuff for you. I don't think you or like Vanini have anything left for me to do. There's still the question of Aladoro and where he went. But I'm not totally sure where that is. So I think all I can really do is progress forward and hope that we find Aladoro. Further on, um, I do think I'm gonna listen to these records though to get some humanity, because there's a few I have. This one and why. All right, I feel warmth. That's one of them down. Um, so we need to do why next. All right, more warmth. I definitely didn't use this time to to edit videos. <laughs> <laughs> That's definitely not what I was doing. Just sitting there listening to some cool cool soundtrack music and editing videos. Play a certain scale. Oh, it's the... It's the title screen music. Yeah, that's what plays on the title screen. Interesting, interesting. Very, very interesting. Okay. Cool. So... Let go. I'm imagining this is like, at least close to the final point of the game. I'm not really sure, but I imagine the amount of areas is gonna go to 10, and this is gonna be our 10th area. As far as, uh, you know, like, main hub areas go, because there's not much room for them anymore unless it scrolls. So... Cool. Yeah, this place looks great. Oh, the Relic of Trismegistus. Beautiful, would you look at that? We made it. Well, that's good. That's very, very good. Alright, so... Boom. Dark Moon, Moonstone of the Covenant. Um... That is a big waterfall. Not a big one, but it's a lot of water falling. All right. Who would have guessed all this was beneath the hotel? Wait, is, 
Is this the relic of Trismegistus? Trismegistus, there we go. You know, it's the strangest feeling. I, I, I think I've been here before. Uh, maybe I haven't gotten all my memories back after all. I don't know exactly what's going on, but someone was dragged away from here. We have to follow. Hurry! You're... worrying me. Talking about how you recognize this place. Jiminy, because you've kind of just been along the ride the entire game so far. You haven't really done that much or anything. But, uh, yeah. Underground, but I see a butterfly. Have I gone mad, or is it from another world? Because, yeah, I mean, usually, like, it's so often the trope in games is that, like, your, your little companion friend that helps you along on your adventure and tells you where to go and what to do is actually a baddie. So, uh... I'm wondering if that was going to happen here. I was looking around here because... It, it, we like transitioned to a different area, so I was like, was there a path I could have went down in here? Because this is where Elodoro is supposed to be, but I imagine this area is just going to connect to the other place, yeah? So. Alright. Are there any enemies? I see one enemy up there, and it's just a carcass. Of course, there's probably something like right here. Something's got to be here, ready to ambush me when I go for this. Oh, you little bastard. Here you go. Uh-uh. Uh-uh. No, 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 no. Where do you think you're going? Where do you think you're going? God, you are going! Okay, there's one left. Oh, I got the one with the booster. That's unfortunate. I don't care about the one with the booster. How? Okay. They are slightly tankier. Oh my god. Ow, you were faster than me. <laughs> I thought I was getting the drop on you. Okay, good. God, there's so many traps here. Okay, so there was one butterfly we missed, and as my luck would probably have it, that butterfly is probably the most important one. So, I think we're gonna go sit, and come back over here, and get that one that we didn't get, because there were three. There's no way we were getting all of them in one go. Wait, did I read this? Oh, that wasn't one. Okay, I know I read this one. Um, but I thought I saw one in there, too, but no. Alright. Back in here to stargaze. Really quickly, don't mind me. So we can reset things. Bop. Alright, so... Are we good? Here. So, it's gonna spawn again. There it is. No. Bad. There we go. Of course it's the one that I needed. Of course it's the one that I needed. So we need one more now. And then I'll be able to, uh... To level up. Oh, you look intimidating. Ow. That was ballsy of me. You hit hard. There we go. This should be death right here. God, you're tanky. It was not death. Iron wall amulets. That seems cool. What do you do? 
Increases physical damage reduction rate. It's the Ring of Steel protection. Sometimes one must focus on defense instead of offense. Nevertheless, one must pay the cost for sustaining an iron wall. Yeah, it's a pretty heavy one. Okay. That's cool. That's, that's pretty neato. I definitely feel like I take a lot less damage now. So my armor and stuff is doing stuff for me. <gasps> we finally get a halberd. No, don't give me a cool halberd this late in the game. Ah, it looks so cool. Link slash and guard parry. Slash enemies in front of you. Use an extra fable to slash uh, enemies in front once more. Guard parry. Hotel Krat was built from a cursed knight's castle. They say that the golden tree that once captivated the knight is still asleep somewhere in the hotel. Ah, yeah, yeah, it definitely is. Ah. This sucks, because, um, this is the weapon that's on Elidoro's back that I've been wanting. Blade of a halberd collected by a Krat aristocrat. Despite being an old weapon, its proportions make it easy to handle. Discovery of the gold coin tree made the knight of the isolated castle grow vain. Knight sought greater wealth and glory than the king, and ultimately fell to ruin from the king's jealousy. I mean, we, we gotta, we gotta swing it at least. Oh my god, I've wanted this weapon all game. I would have been so happy with this weapon to the entire game. Oh my god. Well, if I want to respec for the final boss fight, what I could do is just go a quality build. And we would, we would bop things. We would bop things super hard. My god, look at how cool it is! Look at how fast it goes! There we go. Like, God, it's so good. It's so fast, too. Look at how fast it is. If I would've got this weapon earlier, I would absolutely be using it. Yeah. That's a shame. That's a shame. Okay. Back to this, though. Okay. Okay. Like I said, there's a chance I can respec and use it. But, um... You know. Probably what I would do if I did is, um, the capacity is not paying off as much as I was hoping it would. And I don't think I'm really going to be able to do anything super crazy with it. Like, sure, I can wear the heavy armor and all that stuff. But I could probably do, wear most of that with the plus one version of the uh, equipment increasing ring. So what I could instead do, if I want a quality build, is start putting points into technique as well and have a dual scaling weapon instead of a single scaling weapon and leaning more into defense. So, there's possibilities here. Is that a phone? I think that was a phone. Really now, King of Riddles? So, sorry, I just want to make sure there's nothing... Yeah, there's a bridge across there, but I can't get across there. At least it doesn't seem like I can. It is indeed a phone. Hi. Ah, and it's another lovely day in Crod City. Eh. I mean, yeah, I've killed people. I I think yes, I am in in fact a killer. Ashamed or embarrassed about it. Murder honors 
Chosen One's Trinity Key. Okay, well, we're definitely fighting you later. We're definitely fighting you later, and uh, as I as I kind of uh, assumed throughout the game, you are a puppet. It seems. So that is something. None of that, please. Thank you. Okay, there's something big walking around down there. We're gonna deal with that in a second, but... So, alright, we have a key to a new Trinity door, and it's probably gonna be to, like, a secret boss fight, or not secret boss fight, but optional boss fight against the King of All... Uh, the King of Riddles, I think. Assuming that's where this is gonna go. And the King of Riddles really likes the murder, as we heard. Ow. Stop that. Okay, now what's going on down here? I like the sound of it. There's a puppy and a big lad. Uh, I don't trust this bridge. Whoop! Okay, I could have trusted the bridge. Oh my god! Okay. These damn traps, I swear to god. Stop, drop, and roll. Stop, drop, and roll! That actually does work. Cool. <laughs> Stop, drop, and roll. It totally works. Okay, I think that's the pressure plate. Ooh, vivid ergo crystal. Okay. Don't like the looks of you, friend. Hmm. How many, like, pulse cells do I have left? Because I would prefer to, like, get what's it called down on you if I could. Oh, not enough. Damn. Okay. Luckily, you're very, very easy to parry because of those tentacles. They leave you wide open for some easily timed, uh, parries there. So, that is good. Really, really surprised the puppy didn't come to kill me, because there's a puppy down here, too. Surprised you didn't hear that, friend. Very, very surprised you didn't hear that. Okay, and there's one more thing up on this, like, pillar over here that I need to get. And that item, which I need to drop to, it looks like. Uh, another Legion Caliber. Yeah, we're definitely at that point of the game where, uh... We're, we're getting so many of those things, I don't even know what to do with all of them. But they want to make sure you have enough to... Try out different kinds of builds if you are so inclined. Ow. Really thought that was gonna work. Maybe I jumped too soon? Gonna hope I jumped too soon. Cause like... That... Totally looks doable. <laughs> oh, come on! That was like right there. Hmm. I'm gonna like kill myself just trying to make this jump repeatedly. I could put on the lower fall damage thing, but I'm like. <sighs> okay, that was the last possible second. Thank you. Appreciate you. Okay, now let's go up here and grab this, and we should be good. God, it's already been 27 minutes? What? Where at the time- I seriously feel like I just started recording five minutes ago. 
No way. What is time? It is an enigma. Uh, ooh, what? Boss fight? Now that's not very friendly. I have to run through so much to get over here. You've got to be joshing me. There's no way. There's no way. I had to run so far. Okay. And in the end, it didn't even matter. Hmm. I guess I... Could I drop down there? See, there's like a cave there. I mean, I don't see like a stargazer or anything over there, so I don't even know if that'll help me. Huh. Because, yeah, it seems like I come from down here. And it'll allow me to get somewhere. Hmm. I'm thinking I go back, uh, hit the stargazer, and then just make the run back over here. I think. Oh, that's how I've been recording for, for this long. <laughs> yeah, I've listened to the records earlier. That's why it hasn't felt like I've been recording too long. That makes sense. Okay, so, yeah, let's do this again. Except let's, uh... Not fight all the enemies this time. And just hightail it straight to uh, the boss. Like right over here. No, don't mind me. Nope. This is going to be quite a nasty boss run if I die to this boss. So I sincerely, sincerely hope I don't die to this boss. Okay. Oh my god, it's the Black Rabbit Brotherhood again. Yeah, because that's the coffin. Yeah, here's where they return. They said they'd be back. Oh, you guys were annoying. Could it potentially just be three this time? Or have you juiced up your... Yep. Yep, you juiced Except up your brother. Your fate. Death has come for you. I think you juiced up your brother. Even if we just fate to buy time, you're going down. Stop, drop, and roll. Okay. Demonstration time. Who wants to watch this guy break apart? Okay, who's saying that? Wouldn't mind taking one of you out. God, you're too fast for me to be doing that. Big brother always looks out for me. I'm gonna snatch you to PC. Okay, now you're fighting me now? Yeah, they all have like elements on their weapons. Hey, you're trying to decay me. God damn it. No, back away, back away. As long as we keep one, the one that's currently like aggroed on me in our vision. I hate you so much, you. You're the most annoying one. Absolutely. Damn you, you 
little bastard. We just fight to buy time. You're going down. Don't scorpion me. I'm putting some of these down. Little shits! God damn it, fighting three characters at once is awful. Okay, come give it your best shot, you little shit. Got you. You little shit. You little shit. God, I hate that one so much. Uh oh. Fuck. Oh my god. Get the fuck up, character. God, I should have summoned my friend. I feel like they actually totally intend for you to summon during this fight because it's just incredibly unfair otherwise. God damn it. Get up, Pinocchio! Jesus Christ, get up! You're a fucking robot. You don't have to wait for your... Oh god! This is what I get for becoming more human. Uh. Heal. Okay. God. If I can just take you down. God, my life will be so much easier, but you're such a dodging prick. You dodge so much. And then I get fucked like that because you're a little asshole. Good. No, you should have died faster, you little shit. God. Uh oh. That's that thing. Ow. Right after using that scary ass attack, you immediately went into something like that. God damn it. Okay. That sucks. That sucks. All right. I managed to be uh, I managed to beat the I managed to beat all of the siblings, but manages to finally go down to you. That sucks. Damn. So close, too. It's just such a rough fight to do by yourself, because so much of them is just hitting and running. They smack you, and then they jump away, and then another one hits you. And it's just that over and over again. This is also the longest death run we've had to do the entire game thus far. Like, why is this death run so weirdly long compared to everything else in the game? It's kind of shocking. Like, I wouldn't expect it to be this long, but... Alright, well, that was a good college try, but this, uh... This run is way too long for me to want to keep doing that over and over again, so, uh... Yeah, we're, we're summoning a Star Fragment, friend. I'm fine with doing that. Who wants to watch this guy right now? God damn it. But yeah, they're so mobile. 
and everything that it just makes them very, very annoying to deal with. This also gives you the opportunity to, to backstab them and stuff, which normally you can't do. God, I hate them. I understand you're angry about your brother, but you're also very, very much annoying me and impeding my quest. And for that, you must die. Can we please knock you out of your attacks? There. You're the one that needs to go. <laughs> so if you take too long, it seems like the brother comes? Yeah. Ow. Hey, we need to take you out before my friend dies. Or we're gonna have a bad time. Stop it! God, you're so fast! Oh, and now I'm overheated. Ugh. Leaving the fire when alive was maybe a bad call. Because you're very, very fast. And you have that! God, you did not knock me out of my attack! No! <laughs> Stupid! Oh, I hate them! I hate them! <laughs> Couldn't there have been one less? <laughs> God damn it! Ugh. One less of you little shits! I swear to God! It would have been so much better! This is also the problem with me using- This is where it becomes a problem that I'm using a heavy weapon. Right here. Cause uh... It's so easy for me just to get comboed and demolished. Oh my god. I don't think I'm gonna be able to beat the brother. Yeah, no, 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 that wasn't that wasn't when your fate was sealed. It was when you decided to fuck with me. <laughs> that was when your fate was sealed. God, that followed up by get up, P. Fucking swear. <sighs> God, you run so quickly. Yo. Oh my God, I need a few more hits. Just need one more heal. That was way too ballsy. No! Get up! You and your never-ending combos. Okay. Oh my god. The pillars block that? I didn't think they would. Oh my god. Okay. Oh, this fight sucks! <laughs> We've had so many Souls-like games at this point that they're like, we gotta keep one-upping the other ones. We gotta have more and more enemies. Soon we'll have like an Ornstein and Smo fight where there's like 60 fuckers. All with the same health bar. Uh -oh. oh! Okay. I'm fucked. No? I 
thought I was behind that garbage and it was going to block it, but no. Uh. God, I stand no chance. That's what I got. Okay. Come on over here if you're going to come over here. Come on, you little shit. What was that? A stomp? That's not what I need you to do. Okay. Get in there. <sighs> come on, come on, come on, come on. Okay. No, I choked. I choked. Oh my god. Oh, that fight is a lot. A lot. It absolutely feels like the fight that they put into the game to encourage you to use the, um, the co-op summoning. Because that fight is just ass without it. It's ass with it. Quite frankly. Whew. Okay, I think we can I think we can do it though. I think we can do it. I'm pulling some bullshit out of my pocket now though. Um I'm tired of this. So we're we're pulling out we're pulling out some bullshit. Um What else we got? Uh carcass fluid bottle? Sure. Um I got the fable catalyst. Um Hmm. What does this do? Increases fable restoration. Mm. Oh, are you fucking kidding me? Yeah, this this run to the boss is also just definitely the worst one in the game so far. This game's usually been pretty nice about boss runs, but not this one. Not this one. This one they decided they wanted to be painful. Okay. Oh my god. Okay, fire one's going down first. That's good. The youngest, I think, has the lowest amount of HP. So I'm going to focus on the other two first. Because uh, the youngest will be easier to kill once brother comes in. Oh, stop kicking me. Spectre, are you coming or you gonna you gonna you gonna get into the fight? Thank you. Thank you. Oh, it's just such a clusterfuck. Big brother always looked out for me. I'm gonna snatch you to pieces! Okay. There we go. Now that is what we needed. That is what we needed. Uh-huh. I think we knocked you down there, but I screwed it up. Can I stop losing my lock-on? Jesus Christ! Fuck, my lock-on kept getting lost. Don't choke now. This is the best run we've had. Okay, I think I've got it. Call me crazy. Ugh. Hate them. Hate them all. Die. Rest in shit. <laughs> Thank you, Alucard, for helping me. Ugh. Yeah, God. You just have to bum rush them down, or that's just gonna be a painful experience. I think those are definitely the hardest fights in the entire game. 
for the sole reason of there being so many enemies that you have to juggle. Like, yeah, they're kind of nice and they do the thing where if you're fighting one, the other one usually won't walk up and attack you. But there are cases where that's, that, that's not the case. <sighs> we did it. <laughs> that feels like, obviously you don't need to use a stargazer or a, a star summon thing there. You could do it solo, but it seems a bit like voluntarily stapling your hand. Like, <laughs> it would be so frustrating. God, you get like very, very few opportunities to get in there and actually get a hit and stuff like that. If I was going to take the time, I definitely could learn it, but it doesn't feel as cool as learning just how to proper fight like one boss, you know, like I did with the Archduke. Um, it doesn't feel like that or the swamp monster even. That is just like chaos and my brain can't handle it. So, huh, huh. I think we might be hitting that point where I, where I'm thinking about respecking into equality because yeah, I don't I don't like the whole weight thing I've got going on right now. Um, and we certainly have the gold coin for to do it. Um, so yeah, yeah, that might be something we do because I need a faster weapon to get hits off quicker and um, like. That halberd, along with being a halberd, which I really, really like, um, is so much faster than this. Also weighs a ton less, which is the big thing, too. Um, I also think I can f possibly fully upgrade this right now. Um, so if we put it on, like... Yeah, it's not that much faster. We could also just go for, like, a even smaller weapon than this. But... Ooh, that is a... really long cooldown on movement there. Yeah, you have to wait a really long time after using that attack to... get another attack off. So what's this Link thing do? Oh my god. Okay. That's... A lot less useful than my other thing. I don't know. It would obviously take a bit of thought in deciding on what exactly I want to use. There's also this stupid thing. Because you can just wail with this. Okay, you can just go really, really quickly with that. The only problem with these is they would not do nearly as much, um, whatchamacallit damage. I was really, really interested in that cursed, uh, Knight's Halberd, but I could run the shovel. Oh, the shovel's so slow. Never mind. Like, if I want a faster weapon, we're gonna be going for something like- like, this wouldn't be bad. Yeah, the only problem with this is, uh, that's my only, like, kind of vertical attack. And what were your things here? Okay. Well, that is something. Um, so we got that. There's that. Great Sword of Fate. The Fire Axe, which would be funny to go back to after all this time. How fast is this thing? Very slow. Very, very slow. Yeah, I don't know. We'll consider it, I'll say. But, um, I don't actually know that this is going to be faster enough. It feels kind of sluggish. Like, it does. Like, it is faster than my current sword, but I don't know. It feels a little sluggish. We also can't look at any of Elidoro's, um other boss weapons right now. Alright, well, uh, I'm just going to go ahead and end things off there, I think. We'll see what we decide to do next time, or if I start having difficulty with bosses or something like that, we'll, we'll see where we lie, so. Alright, hope you've enjoyed, and I'll see you next time for some more. <laughs>